Welcome everybody, this is your strategy wolf and welcome back to Manor Lords, welcome back to our uh, again, large village of Wolfenstein and welcome back in uh, April of year 3 and we're looking out our lovely little settlement here, our town uh, our proud town, yeah everything looking pretty nice and it's been a while since I uploaded last so uh, before I updated, bef uh, before I recorded last or after I recorded last, blah, my, oh my brain the summer is here and I'm overheated as always <laughs> just kidding um, before we get into gameplay Let's just talk about quickly that there were some news on Manor Lords out there. There was a new patch incoming at, in the next few weeks, according to the developer, including Fisher Ponds, including Unreal Engine 5, especially, uh, especially. And yeah, a couple of tiny changes, a trade overview, and so forth. I'm really looking forward to it, explicitly also towards Unreal Engine 5. Uh, yeah, we've got to see. I mean, it still looks very amazing like this as well, but maybe the transformation should make it even better and I think my system should be able to go with that um, yeah but we have to see what's possible and what's not however I don't know how much how compatible it will be I think fishing ponds won't be on the map since what from what I heard they're gonna be displayed as um, yeah basically like wild animals or these deposits so yeah we shall see if we can fish in Wolfenstein if not there won't be any fishing that's also okay for me um, yeah, and also I will be on holiday during August at some point, a vacation for two, three weeks where I won't be able to record anything. I try to pre-produce, maybe have a little bit of a more limited program. We shall see. However, um, just that you know, if the patch releases in this time, there won't be like a immediate update on from my side or immediate patch. So yeah, have a little bit of patience. However. If possible, I will of course continue with the patch and also with Wolfenstein and I'm definitely looking forward to it and have processed it, so yeah, we shall see. And apart from this, of course, if you're new here on my channel, um, on, Wal on Manor Lords, you're very much welcome. Um, check out also my other Let's Plays if you haven't yet, and of course if you haven't yet, it would be simply fantastic if you support my channel with a quick subscription and a like. Um, yeah, when I'm passing the 500 subs, I'm gonna get a new microphone donated by my wife, uh, so a stretch goal is out. And I know my microphone has been a little bit worrisome recently, it fell here and there, so I definitely need a new one. But I don't want to break my promise, so you have to go through a bit of the maybe a compromised quality of audio for the, in the meantime until we reach the 500 and then we're gonna go full hd hq uh yeah <laughs> stop talking wolf uh let's get in uh let's have an overview what's happening in wolfenstein and what was happening actually we came through the winter we were a little bit worried about the food situation but yeah we also have a new wow and they're already at 46 percent okay we started our new fields and we were very happy that they were growing um, same over here with the barley, right, where we had the weird bug, or I don't know why, but they had been like plowing it manually, despite an assigned ox, but maybe let's unassign and assign again, maybe it will change some. Well, now it's done almost, so it's okay. By the way, uh, when I'm already here and I saw the other fields, we could actually consider Crop rotation I want to do, by the way, manually in the beginning, I think it is better. Let's maybe lay down another field, just in case already. Next here, next to the... Maybe, why not actually, as a continuation of this one, another Morgan uh, down the road. What do you think? Is this a Morgan? 1.1, wow. I'm so impressed. Perfect. It's gonna be Bali. Uh, but follow this year, yeah, of course. How does it look? Um, yeah, a little bit steep, but to be honest, I guess it's not that, you know, a little bit hilly. But I guess if the game tells us this, then Bali can grow like this and not a farmer. So if you have any <laughs> better experience, let me know. I think it should work fine. And yeah, apart from this, what's going on? We've got the clay, of course, and the clay furnace construction. Yeah, it's clay tiles. Go been going on and we've started to, to trade in some ale i think hopefully did we so we definitely if we want to upgrade to the next level and therefore we need um yeah we've got clay now we've got the stone church so we definitely need ale and we need them in the uh, in the tavern so that's the precondition so we can upgrade anything oh we've got plenty of shoes that's good to see 
in terms of the commodities and there's ale yeah so we've we are waiting basically for endress is it you are you carrying ale or are you just carrying stuff away hmm is it endress the guy or the horse actually no What I really do like about Wolfenstein already is like now these days I'm, I'm loading the game and uh, yeah it's been a while but then you join in and I see these people moving around there's action going on there's these cannons like uh, there's smoke coming out of the houses it's just very pretty these days I'm quite proud already I mean proud well who can be proud of your build in a computer game but it's it gives me a lot of joy to just see I mean the game always gave me joy but to see what's going on and over here are we is this like just bushes, bushland that was growing over here? I mean, we never ran our forestry, right? Because I've been still chopping down the area as far as we can. Forestry unnecessary so far. Well, it's okay. And of course, yeah, what are our next projects, to be honest? Um, we are waiting exactly for ale to come in. Are we building anything right now? I'm a little bit... No, here's just like people down here. Uh, the houses down here have been built, right? The storehouse is working. Oh, interesting, by the way, that things are being stored over here by the uh, workers. Apparently, because nobody's working in here. Okay, interesting, interesting. By the way, do we have... There's nobody living here. Tile maker, okay, that's good. And you are the miner, that's okay, they're working in the right jobs. Are we having any construction going on? Is there an overview? This would be actually also nice to have like a build list somewhere. This... Hmm. Are we extending like houses somewhere? Not really. Um, yeah, but I guess there's nothing huge to do in this case since we've got everybody occupied. At some point we have need people to harvest, at some point we need people to build. I mean, the big project, of course, in the in our heads is this one. But to be honest, are we need... Do we have 258 available or 199? Check quickly. Check. Um, we've got two hundred thirty-eight planks. Okay. Two hundred thirty-eight planks. So yeah, for guess twenty more in use. Wow. So we have tons of planks. So we need actually more stone and timber, and then we're not far away from getting started with the construction of our walls, and maybe we will. So, seeing this and considering this... Uh, where's our saw pit? Saw pit, saw pit, wasn't it? Logging camp, logging camp. Uh, uh. Did I move it? Oh my god. Uh, granary, am I... Losing, or it's over here, okay, hidden, ah, hidden behind the burgage plot. Are we having any unnecessary working guys somewhere around? Yeah, here the oh, live trading post. Oh, absolutely. Or oh, what are we buying? Are we getting some sheep, right? Did we buy some sheep? Did we, we finish our... And it's the communal oven. Sheep farm, right? Oh, yeah. No, I want to buy some sheep, I guess. That's why we should have... I mean, they're definitely very, very inefficient workers, I must say. And, but once we bought some sheep, I will disassemble. Did we, by the way, get also our ale now? Holy moly, no. Ale hasn't really arrived. And we've got, yeah, we have to have somebody run in the... Oh, somebody is working in the tavern. Okay, already, I forgot about this. This is good to know. But no ale around. Okay, this... Case. Let's get them out first and we send some more to the logging camp. We have to increase our 
logging production. Same with the stone, I guess. But nobody's working there. Maybe when we have a family moving in, I will assign them to the stones. Or if the clay... How much raw clay do we have? Um, 18. Yeah, rather. But to be honest, I keep this working until this is um, exhausted, I guess. And then we shall see. But here... Oh, yeah. The barley is now... Uh, it's going to be really interesting to see how, the, how this is going to work out with this field. And I feel like the emmer is going to be ready very early. Since it looks already like this in April. Yeah, let me know down in the comments if you have a clue how this exactly works. Since I realized that this is kind of weird. Because you have got plowing in autumn and sowing. Yeah, which worked pretty well. But then it grows in spring. And it's where here it says no growing. And frequent rain and then crops grow in summer but this is like without a summer this is, has been planted in August, october or so and it's already quite far this one doesn't look like wheat or emmer in in april but maybe there's different also breeds or so forth how many people are we having working in the fuel okay one that's can remain for just for the stand yeah, we had the plan to remove these trees, right? To get also a second emmer field out. I right, gonna do fine. Yeah, what's really annoying is again... Um, yeah. Hey, why can't I just hit the button and... You, if you remember, here's our... Land construction of walls and so forth. Why can't I just hit the, the button and get them going? Even though we did the same with other buildings when we don't have all the resources available like in other games like the settlers or so forth i'm like the old settlers i don't know settlers uh, three or four two uh, when i was a child i played them a lot uh, yeah i feel like from what i heard the settler series is fully <laughs> has been fully um yeah run down or to, to ca catastrophic releases recently i mean this uh pioneers of pagonia seems to be promising but to be honest if I have mana lords and with this more realistic style, maybe it's me getting older, but I do prefer this kind of... These days, at least, I prefer this kind of style, I guess. But it's everybody's choice, I guess. You can, I think, with a good... You can have definitely a look into Pioneers of Pagonia if you feel like that. Um, from what I heard from friends, everybody was quite happy about it so far, so... For sure not a waste. I just, by the way, yeah, uh, by checking a little bit around here, I saw that we already gained half of the influence we need to claim an area. I mean, the claim is not so much, but already something, so that's good to see. And... Texas, yeah. We have tithe, 5%. Food is given to the church, okay. And I think... We have some happiness, but I'm gonna raise some taxes now. Can, we can't go to five or what? Oh yeah, we can. Okay, interesting. Let's take five percent tax or even eight. Come on, I don't want to go below seventy. Let's go eight minus five. Uh, perfect. Let's take eight percent land tax. Um, it will. Yeah, probably. Uh, with yeah, we're getting less people or uh, new immigrants in a lower pace than we would have. Probably that's the result of the happiness or the approval as far as I get it. However, at the same time, the money is kind of the bottleneck that we need to improve our houses. Both for the actual 25 that we need for it, as well as to get the tavern supply in terms of ale. So for these reasons... Yeah, we're gonna increase the tax in the meantime to uh, get this in and then we shall see how this works. By the way, I know little new stone church is really... A, I think it fits super nicely in our little town here. I mean, it would have been sad if not, right? I'm a little bit scared or considering if I should at some point just stop the saw pit from working at all. Before we just produce too many planks. At the same time, I wonder if we can actually store all these... Are we getting at the point where things are getting big, right? Cobblers are here with our storage are here. 
planks, firewood. But they can can they store actual timber? Probably, right? Don't be shy, good sirs and ladies. Hmm. Otherwise, okay guys, I'm having an idea since we don't have too many things going on right now anyways. Um, let's just get another logging camp out. Over here. And... Yeah, I mean, this is like quickly built, probably costs us like... Two... Two pits. Um, and with these guys we can... Maybe... It's gonna be a little faster. At some point we can disassemble one or two of them. At least we can store a couple of more planks and then we can cut down this area faster, that's the idea. Yeah, because we need also these timber, uh, not for the saw pit, I think. Yeah, and we had here our wood industry with the saw pit, uh, yeah, the saw pit next to the logging camp. Makes a hell of a sense, but here maybe we're just going to produce some logs, and therefore there's no reason. And something else, I mean, I was considering in the beginning of the episode and then stopped, but yeah, I want to try it out at least. So, in worst case, we learned something as. Um, I want to build another granary over here. Or not another one, I build a bit of granary also. So we can see what's going on since... Apparently somebody's delivering roof tiles over here. Maybe the workers themselves. Are the people going to bring like food down here that they don't have to run for every sing With a little more like... Concentrated action with some cards or something like this. So we don't have to do it every time by our hands, I'm not sure. Where's our granary? Here we have one with... With stone, right? An extended one. Oh no, it's already instead of granary. This is normal. Are we building a small granary? No. Ah, oh, we haven't upgraded it yet. Okay. Seems there was no need in the end. Unless we saw a need for the. Uh, we saw a need for the large storehouse. And so far, the. Um, um, the taxes haven't really kicked in yet. At least it's not being displayed over here. But with such an approval rate, where is our people? Where is the new immigrants? We need one to run the tavern. I want more people not to worry too much. I would love to have one or two more to run this and the tavern. And then we at some point we also need to... Once our... Harvest over here comes in... Is... Is this green like a little barley? Can, like just mechanically wise, can a field have several stages of growth actually since... Yeah, I mean... <laughs> yeah, it's it's there, it's sold apparently 100%, but the growth is just happening on certain parts. I have no idea, That's, it's gonna be interesting to, so, to observe in the long term. Yeah, I think you can, um, since I don't know everything as well. <laughs> I hope some of you are considering this playthrough also as a kind of a uh, tutorial so you can learn together with me. Or you can laugh at me what shit I'm doing all the time. <laughs> but I, I, I sincerely hope this isn't the case. If so, have your laugh, it's fine. <laughs> Yeah, but I feel like it speeds up our um, deforestation in this area. Let's observe them being building our most basic building. And I think, of course, I will focus over here, but also in this area, and then, uh, yeah, chop down in this, this section. And actually, our approval is even increasing. Do we have... Uh, do, did we buy ale or something like this? this might this be the reason? Uh, no. Oh, yeah, true. Also, we don't. Ha we have to have a. I would love to forbid also people to consume the ale once it arrives, but it arrives. But I feel like there is no. 
there is no real solid option for that. New mercenaries, okay. Um, a blue Mary. Ah, okay, I was for a second I was confused what the blue Mary actually displays. It is the next thing that we have in line right here, producing actually some iron and then produce. We could without any head, we could just send somebody here. This is oh, there is somebody here, of course. Okay, 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 mining. So they're collecting at some point. That's good to know. I totally forgot about those boys. A new family moved in accidentally, and which means I can. Where, where to? That's the question. Oh, to the, them goats over here. Bart Holmes. Once they're done, like, we can assign somebody over here. We can always reduce on timber production, but now in spring, since we don't have to harvest and the rest is running, I feel like there's no real need uh, yeah, to do that. I would like to... Of course, at some point I would like to assign somebody else to the stone cutting, but I don't want it to be somebody else that, who's not living here. So either the question is if we stop the claying by but they're doing good right the, the process is running nicely and we can just like stack up some clay tiles already for the future logging camp finished that's good so get going and set quickly the area where they supposed to work Let's go, chop this down, chop this down, I want more uh, flax fields next year. <laughs> yeah, but... Uh, I can't help myself, isn't this just... it looks so naturally and I have no idea of... Uh, village design. <laughs> I mean, like, a little bit that you have a church and a market in the middle, you know, these kind of things, but this isn't this just... Yeah. I can't stop praising the game. It's considering that I'm not even a um, city builder, a nerd, or an expert. I'm such a I'm such a ridiculous fanboy. <laughs> Easy to impress, apparently. Well, it is what it is. Let's have a quick look to our barley field. If somebody, yeah, this is. I have a strong feeling that despite, yeah, then if you if something is growing already, that the rest won't really work. Oh, but the, no, no, no. Wait, actually, there's a difference, right? These little greeny. Th am I just hallucinating, or is this little greeny things over here looks like little plants to me? And what do we have over here? Is it little more? I mean, we, this was later done, but still, it's kind of no nah, same stage, right? Or is this? Uh, now we don't have any, we don't have a plowed field that's uh, just like standing empty, right? We go, no, everything plowed has also been seeded. Food stall. Oh, oh yeah, here at the market, okay. What are you selling? What are you selling? And who is this? Wait. Ah, oh, from the berries, I guess. Uh, the, yeah, I was like this made me suspicious if we had some ale incoming that they're happily selling at the food stall or something like this but no wow all these shoes we should get some shoes sold I didn't expect to make that many of them but actually that indicates that our leather production now is really working well right despite these boys still having no heights at the moment and, and uh, nickel um, do we have? Are they just doing a taking a pause or so? And we have. How, how is the height situation in our um, in our goat alley? Uh, this is the page. Oh, it's, damn it! Switch is always back. This is a little bit also finicky. It would be nice if you can keep the setting. Well, no goats, no heights around, but it seems like as if they were working hard on this stuff. 
I just have the uh, weapons, not the guns, but the, the weapons I was... What is this goat doing here? Ah, oh, it's part of this one. Yeah, I mean... There's stuff happening. Let's have a quick look onto uh, the trade, but I think probably we can't afford selling them at the moment because at first we need to uh, yeah establish this trade route for which we'll need 160 despite i think once done and we would, could make nice profits with these excessive shoe production and it has turned may by the way may sometimes like such a beautiful and hot month already here we start off with a really lovely english weather Yeah, but we also need the water. Yeah, and since I've been praising stuff and um, I feel we just have a couple of minutes for this very episode, it, it's time again. Let's have a quick look and do some kind of a walk. I think I won't do any big gameplay after this before I quit the episode. So if you guys bored of the walkthrough, um, I'm happy to see you next time. But I think most people will be highly interested to have a little bit of a look. Hello. What's going on down here in this alley? I'm your lord, I'm not shy. Shut up or I'll strike you down, which I can't. Uh, let's visit. Uh, yeah, have we actually checked out our gold alley uh, personally yet? I doubt it. You carrying in the basket? Empty basket, okay, sad. Okay, this is the new bloomery, I guess, yeah. That has not been used yet. Uh, she, what is she? Probably they're carrying berries or herbs. Hmm. I'm wondering if the iron ore spring brought there already. But yeah, the iron ore doesn't have any... Uh, priority since we need them for the smith or like for weapons at the earliest and yeah weapons i mean we should slowly definitely also get the hard for like tailors or something like this out yeah and and wood makers why can't they go here weird i can't i'm pushing w but i can't enter here maybe a bug or maybe I, you know what the bug might be. I have a strong feeling that I'm running against the invisible land city wall. There should be a gap over here, right? Next to the flux field. I couldn't finish it yet because we have to move the flux field. Can I, can I, can I? Let's find out where the gap is. It's here. <laughs> okay. Good to know. If you guys have the motivation or time or anyways in discord server before i forget about it maybe you named it tell the developer this i think it's not really urgent but it's uh something that is noticeable and here our new wood production has started of course people will be withdrawn if you need them somewhere else but yeah fantastic it's not an extensive walk this time just a little bit strolling around here in the city seeing what's possible Hmm, flux. Is flux that pretty and real? I, to be honest, I wouldn't notice the plant. Hmm. And back to the streets, yeah. Just checking out the gold alley in our newest edition. Pretty, pretty, once again. But okay, guys, I think that's a good point for us to stop and finish this very episode we've reached may and not too much has happened this episode but we got more insights of course as always and enjoyed this very start but there's a lot of a uh, lot to do as always so yeah we'll definitely continue let me know what you think what we should do what you have in mind for wolfenstein any ideas suggestions and so forth i'm very happy for your support thank you for that and apart from this of course if you haven't yet it would be simply fantastic if you leave me a sub and a like, like and subscription but sub sounds actually better work but it's the more important one i guess anyhow do whatever you can would be simply fantastic um yeah when i'm reaching the 500 again i'm going to get myself a new microphone and we're gonna accelerate here <laughs> 
Thank you for your support. Thank you for watching. And most importantly, see you next time in the next episode. Bye. Your strategy wolf.